Today, we were helping our friend Jaquan place his girlfriend's Melissa to the gold digger test. Yeah, so primarily why I brought you, you know what I'm saying, how'd you come through is just because I wanted to get to know you. Right. Because <laughs> you're a fucking stranger. Yeah. But like, tell me about yourself, what you like to do. Jaquan wanted to find out if Melissa would be willing to trade him for another guy who has more money. So we hired our friend Ant to pretend to be rich and ask Melissa on a date. We managed to convince Melissa to come to this million dollar mansion and made her believe that Ant was the owner of it. We also made her believe that Ant was a hip hop artist who just signed a multi-million dollar record deal. What Melissa didn't know though, is that we had rigged this mansion with a bunch of hidden cameras because Ant was about to ask her on a date. What she also didn't know is that her boyfriend Jaquan would be upstairs watching and listening in to whether or not she would accept or decline going on that date. Doing this is not even in my, I, I wouldn't do this at all. Right, but, right, right. No, I get you, I get you, dude. I'm I just you. very anxious right now. I can't wait to see, you know, yeah. what he says to her and how she reacts <laughs> and, and, and shit like that because those moments gonna be the defining moments for me. With everything in place, Ant begins to make his move. Whether Melissa passes or fails this gold digger test is now completely up to her. You two. What is good? It's your boy, Professor Rich. Welcome back to the Club Channel. Like always, I appreciate you guys for clicking and tuning in with your boy. You see, I brought the OG shades back and the OG row. For those of you who've been watching me since the beginning, you already know what time it is. I mean, I'm keeping you guys guessing. You don't know if I'm going to do a reaction video, just a regular sit down video, a vlog, a gym vlog, whatever. I mean, I'm trying to switch it up and keep it interesting for you guys so you're not getting the same rinse and repeat content. As proof this is a new video, this is the tattoo I got, I'm saying, the other day, if you guys can see. So this isn't a video back in the archives because I got like 50 plus videos I haven't even dropped yet. I mean, so before we even get into the video, I want you guys to comment right now, what do you think happens? What do you think happened? Because you saw that clip. This isn't even a female nature video or she's a gold digger, she's for the streets type of video. This is just a human nature video you put a hungry you put a hungry person in front of someone who was eating graham crackers and you offered them chick-fil-a she's going to take the bait bro and she had all the props and stuff don't get me wrong maybe maybe one out of ten girls might have passed that test but if we're going to be real if I put my girlfriend, I wouldn't even put my girlfriend in my test because I, I already know what was going to happen. She would choose up, bro. I mean, you seen what happened with uh, Drake and that 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 girl that was engaged or with her dude for eight years that she supposedly cheated on you? Though That could have easily been your girl, too. It's just human nature. She had a better option in front of her, and she took that. That... If anything, he's not hurt because his girl cho chose up on him. I'm saying his ego's bruised. And... I'm more surprised that he didn't know that was going to happen. I mean, it don't matter that you've been with your girl for eight years or that you might be better looking or taller than the dude. You put her in a room, in a mansion with a view, I think in like Hollywood Hills or something, with a guy that she supposedly thought was a rapper who just sent a multi-million dollar deal. And then, to make it worse, which really, like, sealed the deal, he started tricking off. Oh, I know. <laughs> but I'm serious, like, not even on no, like, just friends type shit, but, like, trying to get to know you know you type shit. You know what I'm saying? How'd that sound? Okay. Yeah? Yeah, let's go. You with that? Yeah. <laughs> All right, cool. Well. Damn. Damn. Yo, man. That this was, is... I mean, that was, that was pretty much... I don't, I don't know what the fuck I just watched. You know, but shit. I mean, if you down to do that, why don't you come to Vegas? With me? She, she did has just agreed to. Oh crap! I think, I think he's asking her. He's asking her to go to Vegas. You should put the headphones on. He is. <laughs> so Ant was instructed to simply ask Melissa on a date. However, he took it a whole nother level and invited her to come with him to Las Vegas. Well, <laughs> aren't I supposed to house it for you? Who's gonna watch your house? I could find somebody. <laughs> what? So I'm just supposed to like cancel everything? I don't. I don't even have money to go. That's like why I was. That's funny to me that you think you would have to worry about any money. Well, I got you. Don't worry about it. 
like, what do, you, well, what do you mean? Like, I have to get, like, a flight and, like, you know, like, food and everything while we're there. And, Don't like, worry. The hotel. Don't worry about it. I'll book your flight. I'll take you to a little shopping spree, too, or something. <laughs> I mean, I'm shooting a music video for a few days, but we're going to have so much downtime. So Ant is basically saying to her right now, fuck the house sitter job. Yo, this is, this is. How many other girls are you taking with you? Is there going to be, like, other girls in? I mean, my homies got girls they, they bring in with them, so. Yeah, I just, like. I don't want to be like a one-night stand or something like that. Like, I don't, I'm not like that. No, nah, it ain't even like that, you know? Yeah. I want to get to know you. We ain't even got to do nothing. Okay. You know, we could just chill. Okay. It's up to you. If I got to compensate for it, I can still pay you, you know, because I'm still utilizing your time. So you'll get to kick it with me, and on top of that, you know, you're making money. <laughs> what do you mean? Like, you're going to still pay me to, like, do... Like okay, wait. Well, if you need the if you need the money, you know, so obviously you're doing this because you need to get paid, right? Yeah. So, you know, out of the kindness of my heart, I got you. So we're gonna go to Vegas. You're gonna pay for everything there, and you're gonna pay me for this job that I'm not even doing. Well, I did just sign a record deal, so that ain't no money. Start pretending like you was gonna trick off, and like yo, you, I was gonna pay you the house at the crib. I'll put the original video link in the description so you guys can watch it. I'll, I'll let you house at the crib, baby. Um, but actually forget that. I like your vibe. I'll fly you out with me to Vegas. I'll pay you to fly out with me. I'll buy you uh, your hotel room, shopping, blah, 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 blah. What you think was going to happen? What you think was going to happen? The equivalent of that is you putting a dude with a kind of okay looking girl, because it's the equivalent, and putting her in the room with a supermodel or Instagram model that's super submissive, that has all the traits that he likes. Women are attracted to men that can provide security. Most men are attracted to feminine, fit, submissive, attractive women. I mean, you you hunting, you shooting a fish in a barrel. You hunting deers with bazookas. She was going to fail, bro. And... I guess better late than never, but the blue pill was strong in him. You guys don't know I really want to put labels on it, but the blue pill was strong in him, dog. He really thought this is even in my nature. Nigga, you thought she wasn't going to choose, bro? You should have ran that by one of your niggas, bro. She was going to choose. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I just thought that would be a good, uh, something to switch it up. I mean, yeah, I've been trying to work on my editing my phone right now this space, but... If you guys enjoyed the video, if you guys want more videos like this, send me videos to react to. Let me know what you thought. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell for the for your boy. You guys saw the statistics. 85, 87% of the people who watch my channel aren't subscribed. I mean, what does that tell you? We should be a lot bigger than we are. Share the video. I mean, and I'm going to start thinking of more stuff for you guys, switching it up. I appreciate you guys for watching. Much love.